Today I will show you how to use a Kuro L7 device. This device has the ability to test your lipid cholesterol level including total cholesterol, HDL, triglycerides, and calculated LDL results. From just one blood sample, you will get 6 test results. Now let me show you the contents of the Kuro L7 testing set. Obviously, you will get the Kuro L7 testing meter, owner's manual, 10 pieces of profile testing strips, 10 pieces of lancet, and 10 pieces of capillary tubes. So this is the basic content of this kit. It will be delivered to you. Everything is in there that is required for you to run the test. And you can get this online at curofit.com. This is what you will need to do the test. Curo L7 meter, profile test strip, capillary tube, and the lancet or safety set. Now, before doing the test, make sure that you wash your hands with clean warm water and mild soap. Rinse well and dry your hands thoroughly. Warm water helps increase the blood flow. So um, when you first open this box, a code chip is applied specifically to each bundle of test strip. And we need to transfer the calibration information on the code chip into the meter each time. So to do that, insert the code chip on the left hand side of the device. Make sure that the device is turned off before inserting the code chip. Then turn on the analyzer. Three digit code of the inserted code chip will appear on the screen with a flashing profile test strip symbol. Now, let me sanitize my finger first to make sure that there's no residue left. Then, place the capillary tube at the edge of the table with a hole exposed. Gently massage your finger. I'm using the safety set, I will draw blood from my finger. Remove the protective cap, then place the red end of the safety set on the fingertip, then gently push the safety set against the fingertip to activate the lancet mechanism. Gently squeeze your finger to create blood sample. Then place the finger face up right to the opening of the capillary tube that's sitting on the edge of the table and allow the blood to travel horizontally into the capillary tube automatically. Do not press the bulb on the capillary tube while collecting the blood sample to avoid bubbles to get in. So, once it's filled to the black line, insert the test strip while the lid is closed. Please do not open it until the device says so. So when you see OPE on the screen, you may now open the lid and apply the collected sample to the testing spot of the test strip by carefully pressing the head of the capillary tube. It will now show CLO indicating that you need to close the lid. And the result will show on the screen within 3 minutes. Alright, I now have the result. I am very impressed and amazed by the ease of use and accuracy of this device. There you have it. That's the end of this video and thank you for watching.